Hello there, my beautiful sewing friends. I'm Alice Murray. Thank you for joining me on my channel, Mermaid Designs, where we talk about garment sewing. And we talk about patterns, and we talk about fabric, and we talk about all the challenges that come with sewing. And I review for you each day, each day at 7 o'clock in the morning, a.m., I post another video uh, with another make, and I am attempting to show you 365 makes, and we're at day 122. We're getting very close, like, is it today, is it tomorrow, that we're a third of the way through? I'm going with tomorrow, but we're getting close to that. So today we're going to talk about New Look 6446. This is a, I believe it is a 2020. No, I'm wrong. It is a 2016 release. I've seen this made by several different people on their YouTube channels and, and uh, how it went for them. And because of that, I got a copy of it. And uh, now I'm going to show you how it worked out for me. Uh, you can make a little dress or little shorts or I don't know. What do you, what do you call this? Is it a jumpsuit? I don't know. Or you can make it like a longer dress. Uh, and this is not going to focus. Oh, there it is. Yeah. There's a zipper in the back, which I put in because I don't know how you'd get in this without it. So I'll uh, show it to you and then we'll talk about it. So right off the hop, I like it because I can wear my red shoes with it. Anytime I can wear my red shoes, I'm happy. Um, things I love about this. There's actually nothing I don't love about it. Um, I love the pockets. They have great pockets. Uh, they had a really kind of nifty way of making the pockets. It was uh, like a wide piece. You... Uh, you sewed on and then you folded it over and sewed it around to make the pocket. Um, lots of times pockets kind of come in two pieces, but this was just one piece you folded over and sewed together. Um, there are darts in the front, darts in the back. Um, it's lined. I don't, maybe that's what I don't like about it. Uh, like the lining should make this kind of crisp and I lined it with the same material. This is a uh, deep red quilting cotton from uh, Beaver Creek Mercantile. It's a very good quality cotton. You can tell. You can tell by uh, how, how beautiful the color is and by how thick the cotton is. Uh, but I don't know, maybe I should have lined it with something different but it, I think, made it kind of bungee wedgy feeling. I did not have a red zipper, so I used a pink zipper. Um, the, it has a, a band on the front here that is interfaced, and uh, you attach the... Um, Shoulder straps, it's good to have somebody with you that uh, can uh, kind of measure them and pin them for you because uh, they, they give you kind of a generous amount. And um, yeah, mine was probably six inches shorter than what the pattern piece was. And uh, yeah, it was kind of, I don't know if the word is tricky, but interesting. It was interesting <clears throat> how you made the facing, made the lining, put on the um, straps, put put in the zipper first, and then uh, you kind of turn the zipper inside and sewed the lining on the outside of it and flip it and voila, you've got straps that are sewed in in the zipper and it's all kind of finished nicely. 
And then it suggests you hand sew the waist on the inside, but I just pinned it from the outside and stitched in the ditch. And yeah, I got no time for hand sewing. Then it has this uh, long tie belt, uh, which I think is great. Yeah, so I kind of like it. I uh, am wearing it with this uh, cotton uh, shirt, one meter, a marvelous one meter top that I made out of some other fabric from uh, Beaver Creek Mercantile, which is a quilting store in my community. Like, and they're awesome. And um, I don't know. I, I, I'll hook the video at the end. I made this quite a while ago. Um, I think it makes me look a teeny bit like a toddler. But uh, you know what? I'm going to embrace that. What's wrong with toddlers? Nothing. I like the length of it. I think this will be great to wear in the summer. My only concern is, you know, just getting in and out of it when you have to go to the washroom. I did not put the hook and eye on because I thought, hmm, I don't know. I am not rubbery enough to hook up the hook and eye and then how would I unhook it and hook it up again without having my husband have to go to the washroom with me and most places wouldn't let that happen. So I just put the zipper in and can manage that. So that was fine. So yeah, there has been a lot of, uh, of uh, good things said about uh, New Look 6446. And I think they're right. I think it's a great pattern. I think it's a great look. I think it's a little bit different than uh, what we normally have to choose from. Not just a pair of pants or a top, but... Uh, Overalls. Would you call these overalls? I don't know. I don't know what you call them. You let me know. Um, but whatever they're called, I like them. And I think I will make another pair. I might make it as a skirt. But I bet just might make it as a pair of pants again. Um, and my grateful thread today, I have to give a shout out to my husband. This is not sewing related. He is outside right now. If you hear any kind of racket in the background, he is building a garage so that my car can go inside. Well, also his tractor can, but uh, I'm getting excited. It's starting to look like it's going to get done. He's a very hard work and sort that one. So I hope that you are sewing because sewing is so much fun. Talk to you tomorrow.